A viral message that affects most of us is, uh, is going around social media across uh, WhatsApp, Facebook, etc., which says that the banks are going to be closed starting September 26 for a period of six days. So please make uh, relevant arrangements. So let's look at what this is. Uh, we do know that four bank unions, four bank employee unions have given a call for strike from the midnight of 25th September to 27th. In other words, they are going to be on strike on 26th and 27th. So, you know, some public sector bank operations might be affected. Uh, we also have to remember that most private sector employees may not be part of these unions. So, private sector banks will function as usual. It may also be true that by which time, by 26th, they may also call up the strike. So, it is not certain, but as of now it stands, bank operations in public sector banks might be affected. Uh, 20 8th being the 4th Saturday as per RBI guidelines, it is a holiday for banks, then 29th being Sunday. So, we have, we may have 4 continuous holidays for public sector banks. When I say holidays, uh, banks are not going to be closed, but there could be uh, some disturbance in the operations. And the message also says since September 30th is half yearly closing, banks will not work and then October 2nd being Gandhi Jayanti, it is a holiday. Let us look at half yearly closing. Now, September 30th, though it is half yearly closing because banks follow a financial year from April to March and uh, September marks the end of six months, so half year. So, there is no holiday for half yearly closure. Uh, you check on the RBA website and many bank websites, September 30th is not a holiday. The holiday is only for the annual closure, which happens on March 31st, for which the holiday is given on April 1st. So, 30th is not a holiday. And secondly, we have in between we have October 1st, which is not a holiday at all, it is a working day. And then we have October 2nd, Gandhi Jayanti, which is going to be a holiday. So, this whole message that there is there is going to be a continuous holiday of six days is not true. Uh, the call, strike may also be called off. So, please check, keep checking regularly uh, the mainstream newspapers, which might tell you the, you know, the status of the strike and all that. In fact, the largest public sector bank, SBA, has also uh, through a press release told newspapers that their operations might be affected because of this strike, but they are taking all, uh, all due care to ensure that the operations are not affected. When you come across a piece of news that seems too ridiculous to be true, don't leave things to doubt. Run searches on Google and Yandex and weigh out the true and false of the situation for yourself by looking at the facts. But first of all, before you hit that forward button, pause.